Alright, so I can go into the Great Palace now. Yeah, because it is here. I can now go inside. And hope the Thunderbird's not required. And also hope that I don't have too, like, miserable a time in there with these stats. Yeah, I gave myself, like, literally the bare minimum to try and just survive Great Palace with. Right off the bat of being asked to have Fairy, which thankfully I do have. Right off the bat of being asked to have Fairy. Good thing I picked it up. Or better yet, like, good thing I started with it. Good thing I already started with that. So I either have to go up or hang a left. I'll try go going up first. That takes me to a hook room. And then this takes me to... Okay. What's over here? Takes me to another fork in the road. Alright, I need the glove for this, which thankfully I have. Okay, that's nice and easy there too. Okay, good to know. Alright, just run away from that. Right, so... Okay, I see how that's structured. Another fork in the road! Unless I actually just went in the loop. Okay, I think I actually did just take a loop from what I just... Yeah, I probably did take a loop. And I'm going to recognize this fairy as well, so yeah, we definitely got sent in the loop. Alright, so up the elevator it is, and let's just see what's going on up here. Alright, so I want nothing to do with that. Oh, this screen looks like it's gonna be a real nightmare. This screen looks like it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Some somewhat tight jumps. And projectiles all over the place that can just mess up your jumps if you're not timing your jumps carefully. Yeah, projectiles that can just completely mess up your jumps and get you to just fall in lava and die. Well, at least I'm not gonna die three times. Okay, I literally just got stuck in the wall, and now I'm stuck in a wall here. So, I'm just going up in A. Okay, I just got stuck in the wall going left from that room with all the projectiles in it, and the lava pits. I honestly hope I don't have to go there. Alright, so I really do hope I have another option. Well, I guess I will grab this. I'm starting to wonder if it's even going to matter what I do at this point, because... I don't know, like, this, this could be an impossible great palace, for all we know. I'm not- I'm just not ready to rule out that possibility yet, that it's an impossible GP. But I'm pretty sure you didn't go up this elevator yet, so let's not despair just yet. Hmm. Okay, we might actually be in trouble. This one might not be possible. We might be in trouble here. I guess we actually are going in a loop here. Just want to make certain this is indeed a loop. And that I really do have no other options. I want to make certain I really have no other options here. Yeah, this could very well just be an impossible seed. Unless there's something I really just don't know about. Unless I just don't know how to get unstuck from what looks like a soft lock.
Yeah, I have to wonder if there's actually any way to get out of that. Yeah, because if that's not possible to escape, then we might have an impossible Great Palace. So this is the only way I can actually go. This is really the only option I can possibly see myself having. Because I confirmed that going further to my right just takes me into a loop. Then I hit this room. And then immediately to my left there, I get caught in the soft lock. And then right to my left, I get soft locked. Yeah. And then I get stuck here and can progress no further. I think this seed is broken. I think we have a broken seed here. Only way to seemingly progress any further, and it doesn't actually let you do that, because you're just stuck inside the wall and can't move. I'm gonna roll another seed. This one, this one's, this one probably has to be impossible. Unless someone knows how to get out of a situation like this, but... I don't think I'm gonna be getting out because... I mean, I've never seen anything quite like this before, where I just... Go to the next room and it puts me inside a wall. I've never seen that before. <laughs>